In today's video, I am going to do technical analysis on Ebang International Holdings Incorporated, ticker EBON. Ebang International Holdings Incorporated, through its subsidiaries, engages in the research, design, and development of application-specific integrated circuit chips and manufacture of Bitcoin mining machines in China, the United States, Hong Kong, and internationally. It also provides mining machine hosting services that enable customers to operate mining machines remotely, as well as offers routine maintenance services. The company was founded in 2010 and headquartered in Hangzhou, China. Before going into technical analysis, please subscribe to my channel and tap on the bell icon to turn on notifications for future videos. Let's get started. Let's see its price action. Here we can see that the stock is in a bearish trend and is currently between the zone, $2.59 to $2.27, and is between resistance 1, $2.47, and the support, $2.27. The stock closed by making a bearish candle and also showed a bearish trend. So here there is a chance for a gap down opening because of the bearish trend and in such case don't trade in this stock but if the market opens flat then definitely go for price action trading. Let's look for patterns. In the 2-hour candlestick chart, we can see a triangular chart pattern being formed, and just like in support and resistance here also price action trading would be the optimal way to trade. The price of the stock is currently at the end of the triangle, and there is a chance for a breakout or breakdown very soon so be ready to take a trade. Buy when the stock price goes above the upper trend line and sell if the stock price goes below the lower trend line. Let's take a look at indicators. Here the stock seems to be in a bearish consolidation, but the MACD and RSI are kinds of showing a trend reversal in the 30-minute time frame. An upward crossover already took place in the MACD, but the stochastic RSI is still neutral, a bullish sentiment, but if the market opens with a gap up then trend reversal is possible. Also, there is a bearish trend that happened in the stock and the stock price went above the upper trend line, so there is a chance for the bullishness to prevail. Let's have the moving average chart. The stock is currently trading below the 20-day, 50-day, and 200-day moving average. The stock is showing a tendency to take the 20-day moving average as a resistance line. Also, the 20-day moving average is showing a slight bullish tilt, so there is a chance for a 20 to 50 moving average crossover. So if that happens then there will be a bullish sentiment in the stock. The Heikinashi candle chart in the 30-minute time frame is showing a bullish trend continuation, but if we look into the tilt in the candles, we can see that the size of the tilts is reducing which indicate that even though there is a bullish sentiment in the stock the bullish momentum of the stock is reducing. The stock's Heikinashi chart is indicating a bearish consolidation face. To conclude, overall, the stock seems to be bearish for the short term, so it will be good for short selling during intraday or for options trading. Trade only using price action trading and proper position sizing. Subscribe to my channel for more stock and crypto analysis and price prediction every trading day. Have a great one.